What's going on YouTube? This is Jordan of Murphy's Computer. I know I could have chose a better name, but today I'm going to be showing you how to use a original Xbox controller. I got a Mad Cat. I got a Maz Cat one with your with your Windows 10 computer. Don't be don't be fooled. This is what this is actually Windows 10. Now then, first thing you're going to need is one of these. I made this I made this one out of a broken Xbox. You can modify, you can modify, you can modify this end if you don't want to use it on an Xbox anymore. But when you go to put, but when you go to, ah, uh, come on, sorry. But when you go to plug this into the computer, it's gonna. It shows up right right here as Xbox Gamepad and it's not being recognized. Now then, if you're running Windows 10 like I am, we're going to, have to first do a few things. We're going to, have to go here. Well, if you have a start menu, I got a start menu. Go to settings. What we're going to, have to do is allow, is reboot the computer, and we got allowed in startup settings. Allow allow the computer to install unsigned drivers because we're going to be using the XB, Xbox CD tool or XBCD go to reco recovery and hit restart and hit restart now on advanced startup There we go. Go to troubleshoot, advanced options, and startup settings, and restart. Ah, good old splash screen. Okay. So what we're going to do is hit Disable Driver Signature Enforcement. And I'll be back as soon as the computer's booted. Okay, we're back. My computer took a little while to start up. That's why I stopped the recording there. I switched over to a screen recorder to screen record this, but back now. After you dis after you disable the drive the driver signature checking, the gamepad still will show still will show not installed, but we're going to be using this right here. Extract extract this. This is the driver for the Xbox for the original Xbox controller. Now then, after you extracted it, run this executable right here. What this do, what what this is is a driver in, is a driver installer. I will link the download link and the official page down in the description. Man, my computer's slow. There it goes. I've installed this once before, but I uninstalled the driver just for this video. Yes. Alright. This is the installation process. When this window pops up, it says it can't it says it can't be verified because it's not a signed driver. Hit install anyway. It says it's installed successfully. 
go over to human interface device there it is CB CBX XBCD control Xbox controller now if we got if you go to somewhere like if you open up a game game for life from somewhere like Steam Steam should get recognized the controller as the controller that it is. Mine like mine's a Mad Cat's controller. But this is but this is how you install but that's how you install the use the original Xbox controller on the on the on PC. I'll do some, I'll be doing some gameplay with it soon on my, on another on my other YouTube channel. It's called a Odd Anime Gamer. Please like please like and subscribe if you like this video. I'll see y'all in the next one.